This is Gene Key for SkyServ News. Penn State's trip to the Alamo Bowl in 1999 has attracted the interest of Texas authorities amid allegations of child sex abuse involving a former assistant coach. The Associated Press reports San Antonio Police Sergeant Chris Benavides said last Thursday his department is looking into the possibility that an offense may have happened while the football team was in town. Former Penn State coach Jerry Sandusky faces child sex abuse charges in Pennsylvania. A grand jury report says Sandusky took one boy he allegedly molested to the game and threatened to send him home when the victim resisted his advances. The Alamo Bowl was Sandusky's last game at Penn State where he coached for more than 30 years and was once the heir apparent to Joe Paterno. Paterno was fired for failing to do more about an abuse report involving Sandusky. An earthquake with a magnitude of 3.3 struck a rural area south of San Antonio. No one was hurt. The San Antonio Express News, citing the U.S. Geological Survey, reported that the quake hit about 4.35 a.m. Saturday. Its epicenter was about 33 miles southeast of the city. Last month, a record-breaking earthquake of 4.8 magnitude shook South Texas and became the largest earthquake on record for the area, surpassing a magnitude 4.8. Point three shock recorded in 1993. A September earthquake in West Texas had a 4.4 magnitude and was centered just north of Abilene. The largest Texas quake occurred in 1931 when a magnitude 5.8 quake struck near Big Bend. Adobe buildings were severely damaged and brick chimneys toppled, but there were no deaths. Southwest Airlines and its AirTrans subsidiary are adding new routes next year, including additional foreign destinations. KHOU.com is reporting. The airline said Sunday that AirTran Airways will add nonstop flights between Fort Lauderdale, Florida and San Juan, Puerto Rico, and will add routes to Mexico from San Antonio, Texas and Orange County, California. Southwest still needs to get government approvals for the routes, so it can't sell tickets yet. Dallas-based Southwest bought AirTran this year to give it an opening in Atlanta, the biggest U.S. city it didn't already serve, and add AirTran's international service Southwest itself does not fly beyond U.S. borders. The new AirTran flights to Mexico include San Antonio to Mexico City and Cancun beginning next May 2012. The company said it would announce prices once it gets regulatory approvals. Southwest said it will add three new nonstop flights from Houston to Seattle, Kansas City, and Raleigh-Durham, North Carolina, and one between Chicago and Oklahoma City. This is Gene Key for SkyServe News.